Hi everyone, thank you for joining me. So I've managed to finish the P40B um, for the 80th anniversary Pearl Harbor Group build. Um, obviously this is the first kit I've entered for this GB and there is another kit that I've got in the stash that I bought specifically to do um, for this particular group build. Um, quite a few people have built this uh, kit as part of this group build no issues really. Um, Tom mentioned um, a bit of an issue at the wing route uh, and so with that advice I looked at it and uh, could see that there was some plastic that needed taking off. Um, so just a bit of effect in there to, to get it to sit down nicely. Um, did have an issue with the canopy not to wanting to sit. Um, it, you know when I applied glue and then let it dry overnight and then came the following day it just it just came off again so it was obviously something not uh, allowing it to sit properly. Um, this is straight out of the box, uh, there's no varnishes on this at all, it was um, brush painted. I'll just show you the uh, paint that I used, um, I was really impressed with it. So, so this is the paint, it's um, from AK and it is brush and airbrush redder. Uh, and what I found that it was uh, of consistency that um, because it was, if you like, watered down for the airbrush, it, <clears throat> you know, it, it didn't show the brush strokes. It went on really nice. Okay, there's three or four coats on the on the aircraft, but uh, it, it went on very nice. Um, I'll just show you the other um, paints I used for this. So what we have here is um, we have administrating grey, which was the underneath for the plane uh, from Games Workshop, uh, Roomfang steel, which is the undercarriage legs. Um, that aren't covered by the um, undercarriage covers. And then I just used um, Cordex Black for the exhaust and the wheels. So for the interior green, I used Elysian Green. Um, and then for the headrest, I used that uh, Scrag Brown. The Elysian Green worked really nice as an interior color. So I'll probably be using that again in future. And it was certainly different to the uh, Olive Drab. And finally, the pilot was um, painted in this um, Gawthor brown for his uh, flight suit and then the uh, Yariel yellow for his um, life jacket and then Cadian flesh tone for his, uh, for his face. Then he used Corvus black again for his uh, boots. So this is actually the fourth um, P40 that I've built uh, since I've had my YouTube channel. Um, I've only got two of the other ones and I thought I would show you those uh, just to give an idea of the variation that you can get from the kit manufacturers. So this is another Airfix iteration um, and it's obviously the, um, the Warhawk or Kitty Hawk from um, the Desert uh, Theatre, uh, RAF colours uh, with the shark mouth there, the famous shark mouth. Um, again just a really nice kit to put together and, uh, and no real issues. And this P40 is um, actually a Hobby Boss kit. Um, I did forget who the manufacturer was, but when I saw that there was no um, visible line in the top of the fuselage uh, and that the wings kind of uh, butt up higher up the fuselage, I realised that this is one of those kits where the, the fuselage is all one piece uh, and the wings, I think, are all one piece. So uh, you don't do the normal thing of putting the um, full length of the underwing on and then the two halves for the upper wings. This was just one full wing, one full fuselage and then you just added the um, the, the, the tail. Uh, really nice kit to build, uh, again no issues and nice to have something in the well, the P40 in different markings. I was going to have this uh, uh, on a stand but unfortunately I realised after I finished painting that um, I hadn't uh, cleared the hole so I didn't know where the stand was going to go um, so I'm, I'm going to have to leave it like this. So, uh, thanks ever so much for watching guys, do pre appreciate it. It's a Friday night so it's the start of the weekend and I'm looking forward to cracking on with um, another model. Um, I think the next one is one that I've already started and Joachim's aware of this for his and uh, Scale Bench's um, artillery group build. I started an M7 Priest and uh, I show I sent him the photos so he's aware that I started it uh, after the um, the GB started. 
Um, have a great weekend. Uh, no doubt I will post another video either Saturday or Sunday. Look after yourselves and I'll catch up with you soon.